Hey guys, what's up? Welcome. Thanks for tuning in. So today I thought I could show you everything that I got for my pet bird. <laughs> my pet bird that I don't even have yet, but that I bought a bunch of freaking shit for. Basically, I should have my bird by now, all right? Basically, the way that it do they do it at this local spot, I got I bought my bird from a local spot that is basically a bird store. They specialize in birds and bird stuff. They also have cats and like other things as well, but mainly their focus is birds. I thought, all right, I'm gonna get it from a local spot, be a little bird community, it'll be real cool. <laughs> So I'm the fifth choice on this group of birds that is ready to sell. And basically what they do is they have first choice, second, third, fourth, fifth. Well, first choice has come pick up their bird already. All right, they're having a good time with their little bird. And second choice is taking their freaking sweet time to make the appointment and go get their bird. I don't know what the deal is. It's insane. I'm so ready. I want to get my bird, but I can't because they're taking their sweet old time. Damn them. All right. Damn them. All right. So I got some freaking stuff. And just so you know, some of the stuff that I got, I thought I was going to be taking my bird on a pretty long trip shortly after I got it because I had been planning this trip. But for various reasons that I'm not going to get into, that trip is postponed for a good amount of time. So we're actually not going to be doing that trip. But I am excited to have all this stuff that I got it got for the trip for the bird because I want to do other trips and things. So I'll be prepared. Um, but anyways, just keep that in mind why I have so much stuff before I even got my little munchkin. <laughs> all right, let's let's get into it. So since I have this in my hand, I'll show you this. All right, this is the first thing that I got and it is super cool and you wanna know why because if my bird is chilling in my car with me, I can stick this right up on the window and it can just chill with there. This is gonna be my passenger, my bird. <laughs> I love it so much. The cool thing about this as well, some birds like to take showers with you and you can stick this on the shower. You actually can't do it in my shower because for whatever reason, my shower is like regular wall, but usually showers are tiles, right? So you should be able to just stick this right on the tiles and then the bird can take a shower with you. But what I can do is I can stick this on my mirror when I'm taking a shower and then if it feels like it, I can get on my hand and bring it in the shower and give it a nice bath. So this is super cool, super awesome. I'm really excited to see if my bird enjoys uh, being in the car with me and chilling as well as I can stick this on any window or mirror and I'm like oh my god it's gonna have so much fun because if it's in a mirror it can be like oh my god there I am and look at itself and then if it's by a window you know it gets to look out the window and stuff like that all right so that's the first thing uh let me get the next thing maybe we'll save the best for last yes we're gonna save the best for last all right, the next thing that I got is this little thing and I thought, all right, I'm gonna be staying in a hotel. It needs, I want something for it to chill on while we're in the hotel because with my bird, I want it to be really comfortable outside of the cage and I want it to like have its cage, especially for nighttime or when I'm not around or because we have cats, especially because the cats, but when it's just like chilling and I'm around and everything, like I wanted to spend a good amount of time outside of the cage. So figure I'll start that right away. So I'm thinking, okay, when we're chilling in the hotel room, like it needs a spot to kick it. It needs a spot to kick it. So I just got this little thing, but this will be great. It has a food and water thing and I can just put this anywhere. Like I can bring my bird downstairs or wherever and it'll have a little spot to perch or just have it by wherever I'm hanging out and then it can just perch on there if it wants. So I think this thing will really come in handy. My battery's gonna die, let me change it. All right, and then this next thing, <laughs> I guess this is more for me than my bird, but it's like a little uh, thing. <laughs> Basically, if I'm wearing a top, like this top or something, and I'm like, 
I don't want to get bird poo on my top. Especially while, you know, I imagine it's gonna take a while for the bird to realize, hmm, maybe I shouldn't poop on you. I have a spot to poop. You know what I'm saying? Like train it a little bit, but that's gonna take a while. So this is a thing that I can just throw over whatever it is I'm wearing. And if I have like a tank top on or something, it can go on there and it won't hurt me if it's claws or, you know, being all bird clawy because let's just face it, they got claws, it can hurt. So it won't hurt me as well as if it's gonna poo, it can poo on this and then I can just take it off and have my top under it and not have to worry about it. So it kinda looks like this, all right? I'm kinda into it. Uh, check it out. So the bird will poop and it'll go poop on this thing. So I got that already and I don't even have my bird yet. All right guys, and the next thing I got is this freaking epic cage. Like, are you kidding me? Here, I'm gonna show you. All right, so check it out. I got this bad boy. I put it together all by myself, you know, cause yes. <laughs> And I got this, it has a cool play top so my bird can chill up there. It's got a spot for snackies or water and it can climb on this thing as well as what I really like is, it seems like really easy to change, you know, news, newspaper or whatever there. And then look at this, all right, this is its cage. It's super nice, it's gonna have plenty of space. And it opens up in here. There's this little water, food, and then I got him this little thing so that he can go in there and take a nap and not have to, you know, be sitting up. If it wants to lay down, it can lay down. It can hang out on the top up here um, and just be super cozy. If it wants a place to be cozy, uh, I've got him covered. <laughs> and then as well down here, see to change the things, it just opens up like that. And then a thing that I really liked about this cage is it's got these little guards here, which I've been reading that birds can be pretty messy. So if it flings stuff out, it'll just go roll down, go down there, and then go in here where I will change it. As well as something I really liked about this cage is that I can just open that like that, change the water, whatever, no fuss, it's super easy. Same thing here on the other side. So this is the cool cage that I got and it's cute little fuzzy thing. All right, are you ready for the best for last? In my opinion, this is the best, the best thing. Um, This freaking thing. All right, I'm gonna show you all about this. I got ahead of myself. There's something before that I'll show you. All right, so I got my bird this harness and it's an aviator bird harness. Uh, basically, I got this so that I can put the harness on, take my bird outside, take him for walks, take him to do whatever. He can just chill on my shoulder or just do his thing and be able to be outside and not have to get his wings clipped because I don't plan on clipping my bird's wings. I feel like it'll be happier having its wings because a bird loves its feathers. I mean, that's so much a part of the bird. So my bird's gonna be able to keep his feathers and they also look really beautiful. So I'm happy about that as well. They're just gonna be really beautiful and maybe his, he'll have more bird self-confidence because he's got his beautiful flat feathers and then it can still fly. This harness in particular is designed so that the bird will be able to take flight if it wants, as well as if it gets scared, because birds can get spooked pretty easily. So even if we're super bonded and the bird like has no intention to ever fly away because it's just happy, you know, it doesn't mean that it's, it won't get spooked by something and fly up and then be like discombobulated and then not know what to do or maybe fly out in traffic or something like that or get hurt. Because I did have a bird when I was a kid that used to go on walks and it was never clipped and it never had a harness but we lived in the country you know what i mean like the bird didn't want to fly away um and it didn't have like so many things that could spook it i'm in the city and there's just so many spooky shit out there <laughs> all right now here's the cool thing all right i got this thing so basically i 
looked a lot for the perfect thing to get and I settled on this one. I thought this would be a perfect carrier as well as it's a really good car carrier and it's gonna be the perfect thing to pick up my bird in. But a big reason um, I got this was for the trip that I was gonna take, but I'll be able to use it on other trips as well. All right, so something that's really cool too about this as well is you can close this and no one's even gonna know that there's a bird in there. Um, so if that is ever necessary for something, like if I still want to bring my bird somewhere, but you know, I don't want everyone to know that I have a bird in my bag, um, it can just be incognito up in there. And I love that. And then, you know, it can see out here. I have to clean this, but it'll be able to see what's going on if we're like walking somewhere or something. But then I can also like have this in a seat in the car and just have it open so it can chill in there. And it's got this really cute little spot for its food to go. And then it's got this other spot over here, which these snap and then you can tie them again just like the one in the front but i have to find the perfect little water thing and it's got a hole right there and it can go in as well as i can put little snacks or whatever for my bird or you know whatever bird related things i could put in there as well and then it's super cool because i can just open this and this is it's like you know little thing to change it so i take that off take off whatever newspaper or whatever i put down there change it and just put it back in like that and a cool feature that i really love about this thing is like these are super comfy straps you know what i'm saying like this is a good quality thing as well as this thing like clips so that if it's feeling heavy and we're going somewhere and i've got it on my back i can clip that as well as it can be worn um just as a side bag as well with this strap and it's designed to be really safe in the car like this is designed to go over the uh headrest and then through here you can put the seat belt so it has this strap and this strap and this is to secure it to the seat and the seat belt and see if you want to have these things tied like that you just have this little thing right there and that goes right over there it's difficult to do with one hand but basically you get the idea but yeah i just feel like this is the coolest little travel thing ever so this is basically what i'm gonna bring to pick up my bird once it happens hopefully sooner than later <laughs> i'm obviously very freaking ready all right i'm very ready all right, and then this is it on. So you see, I have this little thing there. If it's like getting heavy, I just buckle that up. Um, and that's it on my back. Little birdie in there. <laughs> so as you can see, it is a pretty big, wide backpack, but it's super light. Um, it's really comfortable. And you know, it's not gonna be a ton of extra weight in there. Like the weight is basically the weight of the backpack which it's a weighty backpack, but usually you put more in a backpack, you know? So uh, it's not more weighty than a backpack full of stuff that you'd have. Like, you know, I used to go to school and stuff. And those dang books were heavy as hell. This is better than that. <laughs> um, and basically my bird will be real safe in there. Like I said, if I need to go in somewhere where like, I don't want everyone knowing there's a bird in there, as long as he's not making a lot of noise, no one would know when that thing's down. So, yeah, that's what it looks like. That's what he'll be coming home with me in. <laughs> all right, and that's everything that I got from my pet bird. Now, all I need is the freaking bird. <laughs> I'm obviously very ready for this bird. Anyhow, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Now you see everything that I got from my freaking bird that I don't even have yet, but he's coming. I hope. I mean, he better be. I put down a pay down payment. He is coming. That's it. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for tuning in, and I'll see you in another video. Peace.